Yep, you guessed it. It's that time again. Time for another Beacon Hill episode. And this time, I think things are going to get sick. Hey OGs, I'm back here at Beacon. I'm here to check out a brand new trail. It's called COVID Quarantine. It's mostly a uh, cross country trail, but it's got some pretty cool jank sections we're gonna check out. No way I'm gonna be able to do a lot of it, but uh, we'll see what we can do. I'm sure there's at least a dozen or more ways to get to this trail. But I usually park on the west side of the hill and head up the Ezzy Trail. When I get up to Wiggler Trail, I cheat a little bit and go around the top of the mountain where it meets up with Evil Twin. You're only on Evil Twin for about 50 yards before you run into the intersection of our featured trail, COVID Quarantine. All right, so the first thing you run into when you run into the quarantine trail is this really cool little rock roll. It's not too hard. Uh, then you get through this little rocky corner here, make a big left. So the next thing you get to right after that entry rock roll is this little guy. It's kind of an option B. Woo. <laughs> All right, as soon as you get through that rock roll, get your seat back up because you got a little climbing to do. A little bit of switch back here, get you around. There's a couple of tight little switchbacks here. All right, one more tight little switch back here. Oh my goodness. Whew. If you go the opposite direction on this trail, there's this little drop right here. I'm gonna roll into it. We'll see what happens here. Oh, that's not bad at all. I think I'm gonna get that on film. We're gonna check out. Maybe right you should have stopped while you were ahead. Oh. Let's get a different one on that one. That one sucked. I told Take you. Two. Right here. So bad. Finally. Enough playing around. Let's keep going down the trail. See what else we can find. This is me. See if I can get it. Yeah, I made it. First time ever on this trail. I made that. Hey, for Rick. Now you start to get a little bit of speed before you head back up. And you climb in again. All right, we're gonna go this right section first. It's kind of easy getting up to this top or to this part. You got a little bit of a rock roll. You're gonna drop your seat. Then there's this. Not gonna happen. And holy crap, it's straight down the other side. And then straight up another one. And straight over another one. Whew. All right, so from the other side, that looks just as steep. Come down here, go straight over that rock, and then into the next rock roll. <laughs> I think I want to watch someone do it first before I even think about doing it. After the triple rock roll, you got this little crazy little rock there, and you got a thing. So it's definitely a lot of pedaling, but it's really a pretty trail. Uh, diverse, has a lot of crazy stuff as well as just the pedaling. Okay, this is just a bonus feature. I'm probably not gonna do the whole thing. I'm just gonna roll, see if I can roll up to it. Anyone have this conversation with themselves before? Yeah, God, I probably could do it. I think I got it. It's really a pretty rude rollout. Uh, I don't know. All right, contemplation time. It looks like you just kind of fall off the edge right here. It just looks intimidating. All right, so <laughs> maybe I thought about it too much. Let's see how it goes. Oh, that's not a good start. Oh, 
I did it. I can't believe I did it. In that one moment, I felt amazing. Oh my gosh. That was a little scary, man. If you've ever pushed yourself to get out of your comfort zone a little bit, you know exactly how I felt right then. A little bit of celebratory time here. Then we got some climbing to do here. Beacon Hill is just that kind of place. It has this uncanny ability to push just about anybody just past their comfort zone. Oh, a little jump. There's two options here. Let's check it out. Oh, yeah. Won't push my luck today. So the wuss alternative is to go this way. Wuss, smart. Is there a difference, really, between a wuss and a smart person? Maybe. I don't know. No, there's this another section coming up here that's got a really, really gnarly rock drop on a rock roll drop so I would normally probably go right about 20 feet ago but this is the upper trail that brings you into this kind of crazy rock drop thing right here and I just see me going so endo so to be, there's just not a chance. Be like shaking, going over. Oh my Jesus! So if you're a mere mortal, like most of us, you might uh, try this other way. Pretty tricky. I'm not going to be messing with it. Above my pay grade. The lower corners are a little bit flat though. So right in through here, you got to watch your speed a little bit. I like that corner right there. And this is basically it, this is the end. Well, that's it, oh geez. I finished the COVID quarantine trail. It's a really cool trail. Uh, it's mostly cross country. It does have some sick little pieces that uh, get it, sick little pieces. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit subscribe, hit the thumbs up button, and hey, don't forget to look behind you because you never know when there might be an old guy coming in hot.